Good morning, Pisces. I know it's very early this morning, but I have a reading to do early, early this morning, so I am up. Um, first of all, I did say today I will pick the winner, and I will pick the winner, and I don't know if I can show you, but this is the winner. Okay. I want to thank this person so much from the bottom of my heart. I love all, every one of your drawings, and it will go on my store, on my web, okay, which is going to, the way it's going to be set up is that I'm going to have a galaxy and all, so as soon as this young man get to doing it, he said to be done by the end of this week, because I got in touch with him. Yesterday, but when I woke up this morning, he, um, I woke up to his text, so hopefully he'll have it done this weekend. Okay, so, um, he need to get moving, because I need this done. Okay, this is the winner here. But also, I will have all of yours, um, drawings, and everything you sent me will go on my web so everyone can see your work okay this is the winner thank you so so much this is the winner it has my initial right in the center of it and i am the shaka and the way that i seen this it just took my breath away because it literally sh shoot me out of it and that's what i was looking for Okay, plus it has an infinity sign at the bottom, and that is who I am. And I wanted something that would just pop right out, so it's in the dark, and also it's like a light that's shining out of the dark, and that's exactly what I wanted. And um, like I said, thank you for all your drawings, but this is the one I picked. Thank you so much. Also, I want to say that... um. Don't forget to wash your hands and don't, you know, the routine already. And I cannot tell you, please, please, please listen. Everything is opening. I told you when the, when things start opening, be careful your surroundings, okay? Um, know that this is not the ending of it. It will be a tsunami that's coming right after this. And it's coming soon. And you will start seeing things done. Again, God's way. He will shut this down again because he says, you don't listen to me. I will shut you down once again. But this time, it's going to be more devastating than the first time. So it's actually going to be two of the same thing moving on with different names, uh, different symptoms. But it, it's really going to destroy more people than it destroyed the first time. And it is definitely coming again. Keep your eyes open. Be careful of your surroundings. This is not a joke. You already seen him shut everything down, and he shut it all down, okay? Shut business that will never again rise. Shut things that you will never see open again. Some people, town, states are open. We're not even open nothing yet. Do you understand? Nothing. Okay? And I live in New Jersey. Nothing is open. Nothing. But Walmart and McDonald's and Burger King, things like that. No, no malls, no major store, none of that. And I'm telling you some real stuff. You keep your eyes open and don't sleep on nothing because it's coming back around. I also want to say thank you to everyone for your support, your um like and sharing and subscribing your private readings. Thank you so much. Um, when you help me, I help you. Um, I just want to send out shout outs to everyone. You know, like I said, um, I love you all. Um, I have meditation book that someone was telling me about they they texted me yesterday was asking me about what book they need they wanted to order a book about the shockers and this is the book right here that I look at so if you're interested this is the book okay 
and you may order this on Amazon or go to the bookstore. Okay, this is the book. For those who really want to know about who you are, go deep within yourself. You can order this book. This book is definitely the book that all Pisces should have, this book. I have a collection of them, um, and I live by them, but this is the book that I read all the time, all the time. It's a book that is for everybody. I have so many of them. I have every book it is because I order all of them, so, um, you know, just going to give you a little rundown on them. You can have them all. They come in all different ones. Find the one that fits you. And that's the one you read. Okay? Find them books, honey. It ain't not like reading books. People that do numerologists and today into, um, Numbers, you want to know about your numbers, read. Read, read, read. The more you read, the more you know. So you cannot know enough. And this is why I read. I'm always reading. I'm always studying. I'm very alert. I want to know everything I can. I'm not Jesus Christ. and um, But I know that I love what I do. So... I study, a lot of study, okay? Um, I need to get into this reading, so let me get started with this. All right, here we go. Like I said, the first three card readings are mine, and that's why it takes long, because it's you, God, and spirits, honey. And um, that is your reading. And I only do what the spirits tell me to do. So um, it's your choice whether you want to stay and listen or you don't. All right. But I got to get moving with this. Okay. The first card you got, you got the four of wands. The four of wands. Okay. They're Aries, Sagittarius, or Leo. Something flipped over the hill. Let's see what that was. Here we go. Okay, you got the King of Cups, and you got the Empress. You got the King of Cups, which is uh, Pisces, Scorpio, or Cancer. Then you got the Empress, okay, which is Venus. The Four of Wands, you see people celebrating in this car. You see it's very red. Um, very red, and um, two people, two women are just dancing their life away. Uh, um, they they're celebrating something. They're connected to something. Okay, but here we go. Okay, you devote. You are devoting to your connection and celebrating the wonders of the love and blossom with your community, okay? Celebration, prosperity, important event, milestone, gathering, the soul, kindness, stable, in home, and relationship. Sometimes, sometimes this is saying, specifically, marriage, okay? Bring the noise. It's time to kick back and enjoy everything that you have worked for. You've been building a foundation after a period of 
this mission shifting, okay, is 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 something that you've been really working on, and it's a foundation. This this after a period of time, you've been saying, "I already got everything I need to do, so let me get moving with this." Okay. It's something that is well deserved. You deserve this. Something that you come into an awaken to. And it's it's telling you to go ahead, reach for it. It's a whole new level of conscious. It's the perfect time to enjoy your milestones event. Celebrating with people who love you. Love them right back as they are. And pass, and in the past, sometimes this car, it really means a marriage or another significant occasion. While connecting with friends and family, make sure you are relaxed, releasing, relaxing, releasing anything in your body that's targeting you of all those lessons that you worked through or been through. Happiness and humbleness. Just know that everything that you've been through, let it go and enjoy living at the moment. Live it for the moment. Celebrate around people that love you, that honor you, that want nothing but the best for you, okay? Love that. Love, love everything about where you at. Be grateful for where you at right now. Okay, life is too short to worry about everything that doesn't matter anymore. You understand? Um, this King of Cups feel like you're taking the crown of this King of Cups. You know, you're coming to a point that I'll tell you, I don't longer feel like I'm this queen, but I feel like I've gained the kings, okay, like the power of the kings, you know, there's a, a, like the president and then there's his wife, right, so that's why they call the first lady, but you always see that president running the show, you know, the first lady comes in and out when they celebrating something or something is a milestone, but baby, I, particular me, I am the king. I am the queen, and you have come to be the king and the queen of your palace. So people are honoring you and looking up to you and watching you move, and watching you, you know, come to your milestones where you deserve it. And I'm telling you, you deserve it because we've been lost so long. Because it's what people's always told us that we were stupid or we didn't amount to nothing or they looked at us like we was nothing. But the more they, the more lessons we learned, the more powerful we became. And that's all it means. It means that when you get into new relationships, right? And you feel like, oh, the first time it's peaches and cream and it's the honeymoon stages. And then you, you start giving them your power because you want them to make you feel like you this person. But at the same time, you want to be like the mother and do everything. Y'all want to be mothers and fathers and do everything for everybody. Stop doing that shit. If it didn't work the first time and it didn't work the second time or the third, whatever, I don't know. Don't do it again. Leave it the fuck alone. Because if you're in a situation where 
shit wasn't right and you go outside of that and shit still ain't right, learn from it. Something ain't right within you. It ain't them. It's you. Stop feeding people everything at one time. Be the king. Be the people that everybody's saying, I'm waiting to hear what this person got to say. I'm waiting to see how, you know. Yeah, that's where you at. Okay? You're the king. People look up to you. Do you understand? You're on your throne, honey. Can't nobody touch you. And the only way they're going to touch you if you allow them to. Because the king of, of, um, <clears throat> of, um, cups is someone that, that is hand on their business. Someone that's love. Someone that, you know, um, caring. Okay. This person is the, you know, the heart is so deep wisdom and love. And they use it to connect. And, and also be a leader. You understand? Love, emotions, intelligence, patience, you know, being um, stable, balance, creativity. Um, someone supportive, being nurtured, a wise leader. I keep telling y'all, y'all are just phenomenal. Y'all awesome. Y'all beautiful intelligent, can't no one touch you, you allow them, I'm telling you, you every sign it is, you at the bottom and you at the crown, honey, don't get it fucked up and get it confused, you that person, and you're showing it all in your cards, you're, you're developing something that is, is profound to me, it's like something that I, I'm a Pisces, and I know because I'm walking in and living it. I'm enjoying it. I'm living for today, for this moment. That's what matters to me. It's right now. It's the now. The now. Listen to the word. The now. The now is the word. Now. Do you understand? Now. Apply it to you. Apply it to your everyday living. Now. Now means right this moment, right? Think about that word and use it. Put it on your head. Put it in your eyes. Put it where you breathe. Put it in your mouth. Now is where you're at. If you can stay in the now, you're going to be good. Because Pisces, we are up here already. We got everything planned. But if you stay in the now, that's what matters. Right now. At this moment. In your presence. Right now. Okay. This person is bold. When something unexpected comes into the king of cups. Awareness. Something that may shake another person. Send them into a state of uh, uh, stress, anger. He regardless emotions state with his with his state of mind, you know, because like I said, you need to meditate a lot. You need to you know, practice meditating, okay? Find that sweet spot between your empathy heart and your intelligent mind. The key to the success leadership style. Allow your emotion and intelligence to guide you as you seek to be married. This logo, kindness and love. And when you seek to be married with kindness and love, that's everything. Because, see, I want to be married to myself. This means grind yourself. Be calm. Choose carefully. 
Stay focused. You don't want to struggle against your feeling and get withdrawn. Okay? You want to focus on yourself because the king, you got to remember, that it's, it's a Pisces thing. It's like we can be here or we can be here. Okay? So if you are in your feelings and in your thoughts, because I'm going to tell you something. Let's break this down. All right? You're coming into a celebration with people that love you. Honor yourself, all right? Let's 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 get this going, Jesus. I need to get this popping, okay? You see that this, this boat is here, right? And you're looking here, but the boat is back there, correct? Remember I said the now. So you here, you, you're sitting there, your hands is in the water, you got your hand in a cup. You got the star there, right? You got the crab, the fish here, which is you. You got the, you carrying yourself on your chest, damn it. You got the Pisces, you got the fish on you. You got the light that's shining within that. The light is shining here, which is you. Which is you. And it's saying, whatever's back there is coming because I see it literally coming. It, you, it, it's right there. I can literally tell you. I can see it. The front of it. I can literally see it. Do you understand? Look at it. You can see it. It's coming towards you. But it's telling you to keep focus on the front of you. Whatever's going to come, it's going to come. But keep focus on you because you got a lot of things going on in your life. That you should be grateful for right now. Of everything. Look at your surroundings. Be grateful for where you at. In your life. Right this minute. Right the now. Please. N-O-W. Now is where you live. Not way ahead of you. Not like oh this. Because right now. If you don't live for the now. The next minute may not even be promised. The next second, yesterday passed. It's in the past. It's memories. But right now, it's right now. You got a lot to be thankful. You come a long way. You got to remember, wherever you at, it's right here. And this is the only part of your body, of your whole system. They can take you into the light or take you into the dark. What do you choose to be with? The light or the dark? Where do you want to be? Do you want to be happy? Because if you want to be happy, you start removing things that are making you think of the dark. Do you understand? And leave it there. Because only you. This is a cage. It has a key. And that key means, do I feel like they got my, me stuck and they got me under lock and key? Or do I open that up and see clear what I need to see and what I already know? Because then you got this. And I speak way ahead of my cause. You got her. And what does she do? She's giving new birth, literally birth to new light, to new her. To a new life. To a new opportunity. Do you understand? It's a whole new world. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Do you see that? It's growing inside of her. She's giving birth. Look at the fish. This is, you can't make that up. Do you see? It's nothing but fish around her. It's the inside of her is water. You are born. That's why they say the water bus. So when that water bus, if you don't come out, you're going to die. Because you can't no longer breathe. Do you understand? You're giving birth to something. It's major. It's huge. You got a coat. A fish. Which is you. You got them all over you. It's you. You got this moon. The most powerful thing is this moon. This shines. 
That's why the eclipse and Mercury and all of that is it, it's, it's so powerful. It's you. You got to understand how powerful you are. You got to understand how worthy you are. Did it all here, my love? Did it all here? I love you. Open it. Let it go. Let what's holding you go. Embrace it. You don't know how good it makes me feel. When I look at this, and y'all telling me, I got it. I know what I want. I love myself. I tell you, that is who you are. And it makes me so freaking proud because I finally know that I've reached somebody. Did I reach you? Did I know that you know you're worthy? This, you can't make this up, baby. You got the whole world in your hand. Everything is in your hand. If you just know how to work this, this is why the sword is so powerful. This is why they're powerful because they are very vindictive. They do nothing but hurt you and stab you. They cut you, you bleed, you sore. But God gave you this. And he said if you use it right, you become the sore, damn it. How many times I got to tell you you're the sore? When I look at this, when I look at this, he's, I'm telling you, he's giving you something to celebrate. He's giving you the king, the power of the king. The, you got to remember the queen is someone that sits outside of the king but the king is the one that rules he, he's giving you this damn it and guess what on top of that you got this rebirth that you're going to get power that is saying look how beautiful and elegant look at the sun is shining the red the moon the moon got spots around it the moon, them spots are coming right into you. Look at this, honey. You can't make this up. Look at this. Look, look. Round and round and inside of you. Is that crazy? Round and round and inside of you. Round and round. And... Look, honey. Look, honey. Do she look beautiful, elegant, or what? Honey. It ain't nothing that you can't do that you don't shine a light on. And you know that. And I mean it in a, it ain't, I'm going to say it again. Anywhere you go, anyone you touch, they will but forever be marked. Because it's no way that you don't meet a Pisces that don't leave a mark in your heart. You got to understand what I'm trying to tell you. You are loved. But when you know how to love yourself, sky's the limits. That means no one can touch you. No one has control of you because you are powerful and you need to know it. You are so, so powerful. Do you understand? Do you get it? You're powerful, honey. It's like, honey, let me tell you something. I'm, I, you know, God is, is, is the beautiful, I mean, he's the king of all. You don't understand what this means to me to give you the word. Do you understand? Because you are so ready to give birth to an abundance and rich future. Do you get it? You're going to have it all. Wealth, everything, but you got you got to believe and not take it out your head and put it out there. Make it happen. Know what you want to do because it's like me. Okay, I done made the announcement, but now what? I'm waiting for my page to open up because I'm waiting for my web to open up because I don't need to be sitting here worrying about what I need to be held back because can't nobody hold me back. And if I don't have a decision real soon, by the end of Sunday, I got a problem. And I mean, I got a serious problem. And I will make it known. 
just put my web up and I'll take it from there. I just need you to start it. And when you start it, I'm going to finish it. I don't need, I swear to you, I would never again bother whoever's doing my web again. Because I swear to you, I'm going to take that web and run with it so fast. See the next time he get a call from me and I'm, God is my witness. I'm not lying to you. I don't play games. Do you understand? I'm the best teacher it is. And I teach myself. I don't sit here and play games. When I say I want something, I breathe it. And I tell you no lie. Put my web up and I got the rest. I guarantee you I got the rest. I'm waiting for you to put it up. And you got to Sunday to do it because I'm not playing. I need everything moving. I don't need to be stuck nowhere because ain't nobody going to keep me stuck. Trust me when I tell you. I guarantee you I will have it running Sunday because I'm not playing. I'm dead smack serious. I will text it as soon as I get off this reading. Ain't going to stop me because I am ready to go. I've been doing this too long. And I'm ready to go. When I said I will announce the 19th, which is today, my logo, that means my logo is ready. I'm stamped shit and I'm going. I don't need nobody to hold me back. Do you understand? I'm ready to go. My store, everybody's store is closed and things is open up. So is mine. I'm opening the doors to what I'm going to do. And I don't need nobody holding me back. Okay, I just need a link that says push and there it is. The door is open. Push and there it is. The door is open. Come in. See what I got. Because I got a surprise for you. As soon as you see the name of it. <laughs> now, that's who I am. Can't nobody correct me. And when you see the name of it, you're going to be like, what? Guess why? Because... The whole world will see me for who I am. My title is who I am. And ain't nothing being sugar cold when I tell you who I am is who I am. I'm not sensitive about nothing because I've been torn now too long to be sensitive. Why am I going to be sensitive about what somebody's telling me? Whatever you got to tell me, tell me because I'm going to take it because i got big girl panties on. And I wear them real nice. Okay. I wear my big panties, what? Okay, because I'm that bitch. I'm her. So I'm telling you, you everything. You are everything. You just don't know it. And you need to get it right. You giving birth to abundance. That means a lot of things is happening. It ain't no bad things. It's all good things. Okay? You got this energy that you got this world on fire. And everything you dream of, everything you dream of, you got it in the palm of your hand, which means you need to get it moving. I don't care what it is, honey. It's enough money in a whole world. It's enough money in a whole world for everybody to make. And the good thing is, shit, you can make it better than me. What? Yeah, you can. And you got the table to make it better than me. And I'm telling you. Be who you are. Be authentic. Do what you want to do. I don't give a damn what it is. Do it. And you're going to be successful. You can do the same exact thing I'm doing and be better than me. You got that? Do it. I don't care if it's a soap. I don't care if it's a necklace. I don't care if it's a ring. I don't care if it's earrings. I don't care if it's a bracelet. I don't care if it's a cake. I don't care if it's a drawing, a painting, music, any poems, clothes, masks, hats, glasses, anything you want, honey, do it. Reading tarot, writing a book, do it. That's why they got so many outlets for you to learn from. Just do it. Do you understand? Working with herbs. Okay? Planning. Do it. Making teas. 
Okay. Everything. Opening a business of coffee. Okay. Bean coffee. You can do everything from your house. You don't have to go open up a store and all of this. You can open up a store right from your house. Like I'm doing. Sell baby clothes. Sell clothes. Do what you want to do. Sell shoes. Honey. Do hair. Make hair. I don't fucking know. Just do it. Okay? I don't know. I done said enough. I don't know what more to tell you to do. But, um, do it. Do it. Sell wine. Make, brand your own wine. Brand your own liquor. Shit. Do it all. Shit. Jay-Z, Beyonce, all them do it. Shit, they human like you and I. What you think they, they, what, what the hell you think? Were they aliens or something? They human like you and me. They ain't fall off the face of the surface and say, oh, I'm who, Beyonce, or I'm Jay, or I'm, uh, Biggie, or, they, from the corner, honey, they started, and look who they are. Are you kidding me? Look at Oprah, look at people like, honey, get your voice. He, honey, I ain't got time. Oh, check this out. You got the four of um cups. Now you got the, I mean, the four of wands. Now you got the three of cups. Okay. Now you got, um, let's see, let's see. Three of cups. The three of cups. Let's see what's next to that three of cups. And then I'll tell you. Oh, okay, okay. All right, you know. Got a lot of love shit going on. Lots of love. What is that about? I see y'all in love. Something popping off that I don't know. Huh? What is popping off that I don't know? Hmm. You got the three of cups. You got the ten of of cups and now you got the four of cups okay the three of cups is celebration again you're celebrating something and and this 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 particular cup shows people you lifting a cup up in the air and you got people looking up to your cup they are looking at your cup honey they are all sitting there you got the one looking at your cup, and then you got the one looking right at you, toasting to you. Do you understand? One is looking up, one is looking at you, and you are lifting that cup up like, yeah. L let me tell you something. When you look at the three of cups, all right, um, you know, cups is all about emotions and all of that. All right, so you connect it into, this can be like family, um, something celebrating with family, a uh, friendship, friendship and abundance, cooperation, communication, closeness with sibling, with your family, joy, um, cooperation. I would say community, celebration, soul connection. Okay, the it's like it's like the pack that you run with. Okay, the pack that you run with. It's like this connection. It's like someone did. You're coming into a celebration of people. I'm going to tell you something. People that you may not, maybe your blood, but be your blood from people that you have connected to outside of your family. Okay. Um, something that. Sometimes we we have deep connection, like we're not close to our family, so we develop other people that we consider family. But it's saying that y'all coming to a celebration. Something is going to cause 
people to come together. It, it's causing a group of people to come together. It may be your real family, people you haven't talked to, connected to in a while. But this particular thing is going to come and bring people together. All right? It's like um, it's literally saying you may not be connected to your real family, but it's someone that's going to be connecting to you. Okay? It's something that can be, be bringing y'all together maybe as in someone's funeral or someone um wedding or something is going to connect y'all together people graduating people are doing a lot of things it's a lot of right now celebration that's going on but something is going to connect y'all together and i look at it as on this particular reading it's a connection that's going to bring a lot of people back together and i look at like a wedding this is a ten of cups. This is two people walking up to an altar. This is the the everything moment. This is like saying, tan, tan, ta, dan, tan, ta. I don't know about that, but hey, it's saying it here. Tan, tan, ta, dan, tan, tan, ta, dan. You living in a state of oneness by bringing harmony and love to your relationship. It's a community, love, soulmate, harmony in a relationship, family, divine connection, heart open, and it's blowing wholeness. This, this card is very powerful. The energy, the connection of hearts, that gaining that love, the divine, accepting, often seen as the big one happy family. It's that yes for that relationship and that love. It's like a fairy tale ending. It's, it's something that's going to be coming into your life that's going to bring everybody together. And I'm going to tell you something. In the mix of all of this happiness and things going on, it's also saying that, you know, you got that, you got that part right, but. You seeing the fulfillment and enrichments in your life. You seeing things happening. You sitting there saying, "I can't miss this opportunity for abundance at this time." You meditate. You frustrated. You're born being in a bit of um, not appreciating what you have. It's saying, "Let check this out." You may have all this going on, but sometimes when you have all of this going on. Take a minute to appreciate where you at. Stop being like, oh, I got this going on and all this. But when it comes to your your career and where you at, you know what I mean? Maybe you're not happy with where you at. Maybe you're trying to get out of that to get into this. But it's saying that, I'm going to say it again. Right here at the beginning of your cards, God is saying, I'm giving it all to you. That's the beginning. That's you. And then here saying people gathering together and celebrating something. You united with something. Someone is coming into your life. But at the same time, you need to balance your career, your love, your family, your marriage, all this. Because it's saying you bored. And the reason why you bored is because you are afraid to take this opportunity, this chance to do what you need to do to make that money. You got the books there. The arrows pointing towards the damn book right here. Towards the book, honey, which saying, get your ass up in there and study so you can make it study everything you need to study to make whatever it is in your life that you want it to be happen. Like I'm telling you, I'm waiting for this man to put my website together so I can open it the door. And once I open the door, it's my obligation to keep pushing and studying, to keep pushing and studying the whole system, the whole thing of the store. How I'm going to market it. What I got to do. Keep marketing. Keep promoting. Putting things in there. So people can buy. Yes. Because I'm the foundation of the foundation. 
So if I don't put the work in it, it ain't going to grow. And I won't make the money. So I'm going to make the money. So therefore, I got to jump in it and put my product and see what's selling and see what it ain't selling and see that I can make more what people like, okay? And still push to sell that one item. Promote that item that it's not selling. Promote it so it will sell. Do you understand? Tell you about the item. Tell you what it's going to do for you. Promote it with everything. That means get to going with it. Because you got this. Somebody, it's a celebration coming. It's a celebration coming. And it means celebrating family, friends, people coming to you. People are coming. You're taking my breath away by me even talking to you. It's a celebration. It's humongous. But it's saying, can you balance everything? It's something else that you need that you want to do. And it's saying you're giving birth to it, but you got to do it. Stop being, saying, oh, if making excuses for it. Make it, make it happen. Make it, make it happen. You got that? Because when you make it happen, everything else is going to blow up. But you got to want it. You got to want it. Honey, because now you got the nine of cups. Okay? You're making a move. You're working together. Listen to me, honey. Must I tell you? You're reading with God, the spirits, your angels, your, your family on the other side. Your ancestor is saying, honey, you got the nine of pentacles, which means that you are making things happen. But it ain't no need to be guessing yourself. It means enjoy the blossom and abundance that you have sown. It means spiritual, mentally satisfying person achieving the inner peace, milestone met, celebration, Energy of success in Harvard. I'm telling you, you are making things happen for yourself. Reaching that one moment of that hard work that you've been doing. Stepping into manifesting that hope and dream that you got going on. It's telling you, honey, it's saying it right here. How much more do you want it to say? It? You're celebrating. You're celebrating. You're making this happen. What more do you want me to tell you, honey? You the king. You earn that crown. You're coming to union that's going to make you happy. You're moving towards it. What is the problem here? You're giving birth to everything you want. It's saying, you got the book there. You got the arrow saying, pointing to the damn book. Are you kidding me? The cup is standing. Look, you need to get moving. Okay? Get the moving. Move, 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 move. Okay, do I got to push you out the door? Because I will. Girl, I'll push your ass out that door so fast, eh? you'll be sitting outside of the door. I will push you so hard, your ass is laying right on your ass. You will land right on your ass. Right on your ass, out the door. And I'm not going to open up the door till you come back and tell me something I want to hear. Do you understand? I step into this vibrating, okay? It's like you are stepping into everything. Cooperation, communication, teaching and learning, sharing and listening, teamwork. There is no limit to what you can manifest together. Work with others. Give, use everything you got for this opportunity. Other people are going to work with you creating something. I'm, listen to me. If you got a lot in your hand, let somebody help you. It's it's. You think I could do this web by myself? That's why I have to get somebody to do my web. So now I'm waiting for him to do the web. He's helping me, and I and 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 um I had Lauren help me get in touch with him. Okay, she's a part of Pisces Studio, so she got me in touch with him. I got him to do this. Now I'm waiting for him to open up the store. So it's things like that. You need people to help you. Get there. Well, get it going. Get it going, honey. Do you understand? Get the shit popping and going. All right? All right, that was you and God. And here come me. Me and you. Me and you. Hmm. Hmm. 
Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Wealthy man. Okay, someone is sitting there thinking. Ooh, thinking real hard. All right. That lovers, somebody's coming and they thinking hard about everything. Whew, they like, uh, uh, uh-huh. They coming at you. You know, people come in every kind of state of mind and you got to be wide awake to receive it. And let me tell you, I hope you're going to be different than what you already had because what you already had wasn't doing you no justice. Okay, so if you don't know what you want, that ain't good. Better keep your eyes wide open. Okay. Okay. Something brand new. Brand new. Something new. This is a puppy. New. Brand new. Something that's in the first stages. Okay. You teaching it. It's saying, who do you choose? It's a decision to be made. It's something new coming. And I believe it's a whole new relationship. But I believe that you choose yourself because this is brand new. It's making a decision, honey. Making this decision, you got one side is happy and the other side is sad. Because this is the yin and the yang and it's you. You choose yourself, but it's something new. It's a new birth. It's something brand new. I believe that you're really coming into yourself because you choose yourself. Long making decisions that's coming your way. Love yourself as much as you want your soulmate to love you. Yeah, there's a lot of new things coming. It says, fall in love when you are ready, not when you're lonely. Something is coming. Start reclaiming who you truly are. You can't, you can't make that shit up. You've been lost too long, honey. Find yourself. Find who you really are. Find yourself, baby, because once you find yourself, it ain't no going back. You don't love yourself. Shit. You might, look, me, I'm the person, I ain't looking for nobody. I don't, I don't want nobody. I'm good. I'm good just the way I am. I really am. Offer. Engagement, wedding, re, rejoice in your union. Honey, somebody is coming, and it's going to be a wedding. I keep saying this. No contact, 5D, dream, nightmare. Focus on your own happiness. Happiness, honey, focus on you. Because when you focus on you, everything else falls into place. Stuck, block, third party, silent, um, a barrel. Shift your focus on clearing your energy. Whatever it is that's blocking you, that you feel like they're literally blocking you, then block you from being happy, block you from your success, block you from seeing things that you need to see, but you sitting there not believing it. You want to block it out, out of your mind and keep being stuck on stupid stuff. You need to come out of that shit because you're not going to see the good because you're stuck on stupid stuff, okay? Changing in the wind. It's a change in the wind, and you need to go with it, okay? Because you're walking this way, and the wind is blowing that way. It ain't like it's blowing you this way. It's blowing that way. Blowing off you, okay? Everything is going this way. And there's going to be a change in your relationship and all of that, okay, for the best. Be flexible. Be flexible with your relationship with your career, with everything, flex yourself. Act like you know. And it's time to make a decision. Okay? Because there's a fork in the road. And I see one, two, three. Which 
One, two, three, four, five. I see a lot of decisions that you need to make. Your mind is so overwhelmed with everything that you can't even see in front of you. You need to make decisions, honey. You need to know which way you want to go because it, it's too much and you um you don't know which way you want to go right about now. Earth magic. The cat is sitting there playing with the um shakas, stones, and she is there working that magic. And, of course, it is at night. When is you, baby? Make it happen. Season harbor. Anything you harbor is going to grow. And you got to learn. Good soil, good water. That means drink water, plenty of water. Take care of yourself so everything in you will grow. You will be successful. Because once you plan it and you take care of it and you execute it and you work at it and work at it and work at it, market it, market it, and talk about it and put it up in the air and everything yeah, and move and make, just keep talking and talking and talking. You're going to be very successful. You have no reason to look no further. It's right there. Give love because when you give love, you receive love. We all can eat and be healthy and be wealthy and be rich. Everything is there, but you got to give love to get love, honey, okay? And give it in the right way, okay? It's saying right here, speak your mind. Speak your mind, because you know what? Speak it. Speak your mind, honey. You ain't, speak your mind, all right? You see, speak your mind. God comes in many diff different forms and ways. Speak your mind. You ain't got nothing to hide. You need to speak it and, and, and let it be heard. Speak your mind and make sure you know what you're saying, okay? Don't feed it too much because when you feed it too much, a fire. And it's something that you're speaking that you cannot just keep it to yourself. Because it's almost like you, you're you speaking this wish. It says speak your mind. And these little things here is some little things that you get outside and you blow on and people say, blow it and make a wish, right? But here it says, speak your mind. It got two cats. And the cats are looking in. Y'all both are blowing things. He's She's blowing. Actually, he's sitting there allowing her to blow both of them, his and hers. Speak your mind because when you speak it, speak it to God. Speak it. Be direct to him. Tell him what you want. Speak your mind to him. Tell him what you want. Ask him. You, you, you're blowing the wish, right? He's saying, you ain't got a wish. Tell me. I'm here listening to you. Talk to me. Speak it to me. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Hello. Be right within yourself. Explore, express your love. Go ahead and make the romance suggestions. To those who's there and there, hey, do what you got to do. <clears throat> Getting to know each other. As you reveal your inner self to each other, you bond deeply. Hey, baby, if y'all there, get it going, honey, because I ain't nowhere near. But I'm in love with me, and that's all I know, so I can bond with myself and love myself, because it's definitely about me. All right? Pisces, know that I love y'all. Be happy. Stay focused. Your surroundings. Okay? Connect to yourself. Connect to this birth that you're giving. Give it birth. Okay? Learn to balance yourself. Remember that everything that you're going through is here. And you are the one that controls here. Your thoughts. If you keep stuck in your thoughts and it's all what is not serving you, then that's what you're going to get. If you remove it and look at what it is, the bigger picture that you choose you over them, that's what you're going to get. But you got to move out of what's not good and let it go because it's here. These people ain't got no hold of you. It's you. They ain't got no hold of you. Can't nobody put them like that unless they really going to do it. Okay? Because it's here. All right? I love y'all. Sky's the limits. Reach your goal. Reach for the stars. You got it in your hand. You got the whole world in your hand. Love you.